Hello everybody and welcome to another devlog for The Serpent and the Seed, the cosy little 2D adventure game based on the big story of the Bible that our team's been working on for the past three and a bit years. This week we've been working on a section of the game from Act 2 that we call the Family Tree, so it kind of represents the, the different branches of Adam and Eve's descendants. Hello, Pepper. Uh, so today I've got a new scene that I'm going to be working on. Greg, our artist, has sent through some artwork for this scene. It's kind of set outside this big secret door. I wonder what's going to be inside. Um, so I want to do the, the basic layout. He tends to give me these kind of reference images that, that show where everything goes and then all the separate assets and I can position them where they need to be. It's time to give my cats some lunch, Captain and Pepper, there you go, and uh, myself some lunch as well. I'm going to do a saga leaf pie today. Uh, it just needs 22 minutes. is ready. Uh, I'm just eating by myself today because my wife's out, but her influence is still felt in the fact that there's green on my plate. After lunch I often like to go for a walk in the cemetery. It's always so nice and peaceful here. Especially when making a game that's themed about trees. I always feel like I never fail to, to get a good idea in the cemetery. Ah, I can even hear the woodpecker today. There's so many really interesting monuments in the cemetery. This one's my absolute favourite. Anne Elizabeth Robertson, who passed from death unto life January the 15th, 1902. The great object of her life was to lead men to Christ, and she being dead, yet speaketh. Right, so this afternoon my job is to uh, put in the walk paths where the player can move around the scene, uh, possibly rig up some state machines for those different uh, locks on the door and things to keep track of what's going on there, um, and join it up with the previous scene so that the player can walk around. So nothing too complicated, uh, but just some stuff that would be good to get done. <laughs> editing job I need to do quickly. Uh, we've been invited to exhibit the game at WASD uh, at the London Games Festival next month uh, and they just need a quick show reel. Um, so this is the progress I've made today. I'm starting to feel pretty happy with it. So you can you can walk around the scene. 
and then uh, for now I've just put in these little buttons so when I press this it's going to make a silly little noise I'm not actually sure where this noise comes from because it's not the noise I've asked it to make but anyway um, so I can make this lock start glowing uh, there'll be a little bit of dialogue you saw a lock with a star in it pulsing gently maybe some kind of swipe would be enough to unlock it so let's try that shall we oh look it's unlocked oh, and that's the noise that I selected so I've just figured out what's going on there and now I can slide this bar away hmm. should be able to do the same for the others as well Ta-da! there you go so I'm feeling pretty happy with that uh, we'll get the doors opening another time so that's me done for today. Thanks for watching. Um, and if you want to find out more about the serpent and the seed, do check out our website at the link below, uh, or you can subscribe to this channel to get all the latest devlogs.